In 2013, The Economist argued that BRICS uh, should actually be spelt uh, with a capital B-R-I-C and the S should be a small letter. How does South Africa turn our small S into a big one? Well, I, I wouldn't uh, pretend to know how to advise another country. I think the whole issue of what we need to do to accelerate our growth, which is the only way that we can become bigger letters, is there's some general truths and there are some things that are very country specific. You know, I think uh, some, the general truths, which I think in India we have certainly found very important, you really cannot grow if you cannot have a high rate of investment. And I think that in our case, we tried very hard with some success to raising the rate of investment. In the old days, people used to raise the rate, hoping to raise the rate of investment would count on public investment to do this. I think over a couple of decades and more, people have realized that actually the real, uh, the search for efficiency and economic dynamism depends on being able to raise private investment, both by the bigger corporations, but also by smaller companies, individual firms, etc. So I think that, you know, I don't believe there's a lot of talk about economic reforms, all of which is very important. Yeah. But in the end, if investment rates do not rise, it's very difficult to raise the growth rate. Now, we, we were able to raise the investment rate in India sometime in the mid, uh, to, in around 2009, 10, to something of the order of 34%. Uh, which is a big increase from what it was earlier, which was in the kind of late 20s. Um, and I think that has come down after the financial crisis. And of course, in the case of, in the present situation of COVID, it's come down further. I'm sure that South Africa has the same problem with declining investment levels. But yeah. you know, the overall levels of investment in South Africa, from what I remember, have been relatively modest, sort of more in the order of uh, 13, 14, 15 percent, that kind of thing. And I think, you know, if you really want to grow, South Africa needs to aim at jacking up the investment rate by at least 7 or 8 percent of GDP, a lot of it coming from the private sector, but of course the public sector has a big role to play yeah. in building the infrastructure. Current events, developing stories, Tough questions. Your voice making a difference. This is Breakfast with Bongani Bingwa.